Hello, my name is Benjamin. I'm master candidate at Wuhan University Economics and Management School. And the study, our studies presentation today is agricultural trade competitiveness and influencing economic factors, a study on China's agricultural trade. Moving forward, let's look at the overview of our today's study presentation. The purpose of the study was to provide an understanding of the competitiveness of Chinese agricultural products in the market for developing countries. And also analyzes some number of economic determinants, including exchange rate, FDI, uh, GDP, and inflation by using Myama and Ghana and by employing the panel data regression model. To the introduction of what a competitiveness is, actually a country's export is a measure of its competitiveness and the ability of that country's agricultural product to continue to turn a profit in the global market. That determines how competitive that country it's moving forward, the research question, we then design these two questions for our study. What is the trend of China's agricultural competitiveness with respect to these two countries that we selected, Myama and Ghana? And what are the economic factors that significantly influence China's agricultural competitiveness with these countries. These two research methods were developed to were employed to for our study. That is the RCA and the RSCA, the revealed comparative advantage and the revealed symmetric comparative advantage. These two methods were developed were employed to measure the competitiveness of China's agricultural product with the two selected countries. And our model construction was designed to find the influencing factor, the determinant factors that actually affect uh, the competitiveness of the agricultural trade between these countries. So GDP, FDI, real exchange rate, and inflation were the independent factors. And RCA was that the competitiveness was the dependent factors for our model construction. The agricultural product that was included in our study was derived from the United Nations Com Trade Database and the SITC REF4 of the agricultural product trade, which included the category zero, the category one, the ca category two, and the category four. And these were the agricultural products that were used for our study. From the results of the competitiveness for Myama and Ghana, using the RCA and the RSCA, we found that the China has a strong comparative advantage, that is competitiveness of agricultural trade with both countries. We can see that the RCA were greater, mostly greater than one in Myanmar, except for 2018, showing that a strong, a strong competitiveness of agricultural trade with these countries, same with Ghana, but except with 2011, and 2015, which showed a weak competitiveness. But in all, we can see that China has a stronger competitiveness with Myanmar than with Ghana. So this were the result from our competitiveness. And from the data regression results, we, can, we also saw that GDP, and real exchange rate of these countries affect 
China's agricultural competitiveness with them. And what does this mean? What does this result mean? And the competitiveness and the significance was at 1%, which was used in our study. From the conclusion of our study, we can draw that the analysis shows that Ghana and Myanmar GDP and the real exchange rate are positive and have significant effect on China's competitiveness with them. This is a result in line with China's win-win cooperation with shared mutual benefit and growth. The result also proves to the economic fact that comparative advantage is actually associated and revealed in economic growth. That is, we can see that GDP was significant to the competitiveness of China's agricultural trade with these countries. The study also proved to the economic fact and to the extent that comparative advantage, that is competitiveness, is also a determinant for a country's performance, for a country's economic performance. Moreover, it has also shows that the competitiveness is revealed in economic growth and the share of agricultural product is also included in the growth of this country. Thank you for your listening.